Yo, what is up, everybody, and welcome back to some more Kirby's Epic Yarn. In the last episode, we started things off here in Waterland by doing Splash Beach, Blub Blub Ocean, and Secret Island. And in this episode, we're going to be continuing and finishing things off in Waterland, starting things off with Deep Dive Deep. Let's get right into it. Ready? I'm always ready. And this music is phenomenal. This level is pretty cool. I like this one too. Just so many unique levels in this game. It's just unbelievable. Give me those beads! Ugh! Don't worry, I'll get it in the last one right here. Sniper. Sniper, call me Chris Kyle. That doesn't make sense. It's like an underwater volcano, so I guess it makes sense. I don't want to get rid of it. Ah! I didn't even touch that. Screw you, game. I don't like you anymore. I don't like this level. <laughs> These things, I don't know if these things have a name, but if they do, it's probably pretty cool. Give me those, give me these. Nice. Ah! Oh! Don't touch him, it's very sparkly. It's scary. Hey! Beads! Oh god, <laughs> thought that would be risky. Alright, he's gonna try and suck you in, he's gonna get tired. I you just throw him around like a freaking rag doll. There's your two star. Pretty epic, I guess. Ah! Don't let him suck you in. So I think he'll spit you out into those Gordos. And then just throw him. Oh, I would have thrown him at those Gordos. And we got Dangler Light. This thoughtful nightlight goes out when you fall asleep. Nice. I need one of those. Just kidding. And here we go. We got a little chasing. This reminds me of the eel part in Mario Bros. DS in like World what? Eight. We're getting chased by that giant eel. All right, screw that patch. I don't care. Oh god! <laughs> don't get stuck. Don't get stuck, bro. Oh god! I should have said that. I feel like a weirdo now. No, I want that crystal star. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope we get the stuff for this, but oh, he's sad. What you get, loser? I'm not going to try to touch him. I was curious if, if I touched him, what would happen, but I don't really care. And we get Dolphin again. Freaking baller. Oh, God. The baller item. Metamorphics, I guess. <laughs> I shouldn't say item. <laughs> Dolphins are not items. Wait, let's get these beads. Ah, I went too fast. I got scared. And then let's get our next treasure. Mast. Putting this in your room may lead you to random bouts of swashbuckling. Whatever that means. I'm going to pretend like I know what this game is talking about. Ooh. I can't go backwards on that. That's kind of whack. Ah. Give me that crystal star. And let me get this too. Let me get these beads. I didn't know there was beads up here. But now I guess I do. Huh! Blah! There we go. Oh, I was thinking about risking it for the biscuit. And I was like, I probably shouldn't. I already got hit once. I'm, already, I'm only at bronze. Ah! Oh, I still got hit. No! Oh, God! I'm playing this very risky right now. <laughs> I don't like it. There's your two star, or three star patch, I guess. You know, sometimes you just gotta risk it. Risk it for the biscuit. Am I right, Dad? You just gotta freaking send it. Freaking send it, dude. There's nothing over there? Alright, cool. We can go over this way. Go down here. Get those beads. Then go up here. And break this. They'll, slough, they'll slowly fall, so don't get crushed by them. If you do, you're kind of an amateur. And you got deep dive deep music. Just gonna keep on swimming. Oh, I'm very terrified. We are nearing the end of level, and we only have just got our silver. I think we're chilling. I think we'll, I guess we'll find out. <laughs> I mean, if I get close enough, if I get the five star, I should be good. Which I just got the patch for, so. And we just need to collect these beads. I think we should be good. And there's a good star here. Yep, we're chilling. Alright, that actually was terrifying. <laughs> Not gonna lie. <laughs> but there we go. First level done. And only level, pretty much, in this episode that we're doing. Because next, we head into the boss.
Bam! Looks like a pot from something in Legend of Zolda. Dad, we got 1,670 beads, or 88 streak, and all three treasures. Nice. Bring up to 71,000. And our octopus nook. Tom nook. All right. I'm just going to throw this. Oh, my God. What, an, what a throw in the water. That was an insane throw. So, we got Tom nook in this game. Oh, the octopus is going to go in there. Ah, oh, now he's chilling. Now he's chilling like a villain. Literally, because it's the boss. <laughs> Cap Amari. Dude, this boss is the best. <laughs> Cap. I don't like this boss. One bit. This boss is the lamest one in this game. Hands down. And if you agree, if you don't agree with me, you capping, dog. <laughs> At least there's no Waddle Dees in this one to get freaking destroyed. Ah! Big scary Cap Amari. Alright, starting things off with Cap Amari. He's gonna be starting things with these little tentacles. If you like that stuff, please leave. Can I I had I was practicing this and I was having the most trouble grabbing on his tentacles and grabbing on his little cap. What I do wanna do is just wanna keep going. Don't get hit by his, or don't get grabbed by his tentacles, or they will throw you across the stage, and it won't be good. Give me it. There we go. Uh, can we get this? Oh, dang it. All right, we don't have any beads, so that's okay. Give me the rest of that, and throw them at it. You get some extra beads. Nice. Oh. Now we have only one half of his cap left. Maybe you throw it ahead and get yeah, you get a little extra more beads. Nice, nice. Okay. Stop collecting beads and let's actually do the boss. If you're good at maneuvering, you can move your maneuver your way through this boss like it's no one's business. Just go ham. But I don't really want to lose my beads. So I'm going to take this chill. Come on. Oh, no. I went too fast. I went too much. Too much. Too much lamb sauce. All right. Let's grab it a little more. And that doesn't count as a hit, which is stupid. Now he's PO'd, bro. He's going to go into a second phase. And he's going to make the screen all goopy goo. Now, I hate grabbing these things. You'll see in a second. These things are so weird. I just want to... What? Suck me. Oh, I can grab those again? Okay, show me, show yourself. Oh, I guess, whatever. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Come on, come on, come on, come on, grab Are you kidding me, bro? Oh, I can grab one of those? Nice. All right, he's going to show himself. Oh, my God. I didn't mean to throw it diagonally, you stupid Kirby. I guess that was my fault. I shouldn't blame Kirby for my mishaps. I apologize, Corbin. All right, let's pretend like this is the first go around. I'm dead. All right, let's grab this. I'm not very good at any of these bosses in this game, if you can tell already. So don't expect a whole lot from me. What is going on? Oh God, they go diagonally. All right, where are you at? Okay, you're right here. Throw normally. There we go. And then he's gonna have to do some beads. And there we go. Oh god. He's gonna start going diagonally through all of them. And we're already at our platinum rank. So that's nice. Just gonna keep collecting beads in case I keep getting hit, which I probably will. And now he's gonna come back up, do his little goopy goo again. Come on, gimme, there we go. And bada bing, bada boom! Nice! Good thing I had my platinum then, because I wouldn't have gotten any beats. <laughs> Very epic. We did all right on that boss. I mean, it was way better than the Hot Wings. <laughs> We got 3,017 beads, 71 streak, and none of the treasures. <laughs> Cap Mario music. 
and treasure pat treasure match pat trap whatever we did it we got the magic yarn the magic yarn shimmered and spiraled and swirled high into the sky its way into the fabric of the kingdom and stitch two pieces of patch land together. Back in Dreamland, it was total chaos over at Castle DDD. What is going on here? It appeared that Yin Yarn's Waddle Dee imposters had captured them off. the real Waddle Dees. You can't be mean to my Waddle Dees. Only I can be mean to my Waddle Dees. That was when Yin Yarn's troops decided to show King DDD who was boss. Hey, that tickles. Okay, that hurts. Yeah, uncle. And in no time, they had King DDD wrapped up like a birthday present. Yeah! Only one more step and Dreamland will be mine. What an honor to have a king serving me. Yin Yarn's sock began to glow and sucked King DDD right inside. <laughs> Dreamland will be mine. Not sure what I'll do with it, but I'll figure something out. But no one stopped Yin Yarn from tearing apart the very fabric of Dreamland. Dude, this game and its puns. Let me tell ya. I love it. <laughs> there we go. Yin Yarn has captured King DDD. The worst heavyweight in Smash. So I guess that's a good thing. We have unlocked Snowland. And with our treasure map patch, it's gonna throw that right there. Throw that right there. Holy crap, we're rich. And ladies and gentlemen, Welcome to one of the hardest levels up to this point in this game. And maybe even one of the hardest levels in this game. You will see why in the next episode. So, I think we're going to end things off here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Kirby's Epic Yarn. If you wanted to enjoy, please go ahead and leave a like if you haven't yet. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And also, hit the notification bell directly next to the subscribe button. So, you always get notified whenever I post another banger. Where's the secret level at? Oh, it's right under there. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys. Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Next episode, we tackle the hardest level in this game. Or one of the hard levels. I don't know. I don't know which one it is. But anyways, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Remember, stay sexy because he's a real MVP. Yeah, get it. Get all of it. Shake your thing. Go, uh, go, 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 go. Oh, oh yes. Oh, 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 I couldn't get in. I couldn't. Oh,